first of all the whole contraption uh, three pounds and seven eighths of an ounce or if you want it in new money uh, 1.392 kilograms uh, that's the entire contraption without the uh, the actual uh, effect enhancing weight I think is what I've called it uh, and now just to prove that that really was a, a four pound weight or if you want it uh, 1.834 kilograms just shows you that piece of string weight weighs three quarters of an ounce um, I'm going to have to take this back to the kitchen before my wife finds it missing so you'll excuse me if I cut now usual arrangement thread holding elastic band under tension I've got a, a ruler set up here I'm afraid it's in inches because that's where my brain was wired up uh, with the edge of the ruler in line with the, uh, the string carrying the four pound effect enhancing weight um, and once I spun the gyros up I shall just burn through this string to release the elastic band's torsional power As I think you can see quite clearly that the weight has moved about an inch and a quarter, inch and a half, but so has the mainframe which started at around about the four inch point. So the whole shebang has uh, moved in the one direction. Now I don't know about you but to me uh, that doesn't seem to go along with the third or in the slightest. This really is just the return stroke or the second part of the cycle. Um, I'm starting it now in the position it would be when it has processed the weight forwards. And if you'll remember, the weight has moved, the frame has hardly moved at all. This now is the Newtonian cycle. The gyro is switched off in reality here in the, uh, the patented device at this stage. Um, what I'm going to do this time, we've got an elastic band uh, to bring the slider back in this direction. Uh, and just to prove that Newton's <laughs> the laws are very well based, uh, we'll release the, the tension of the elastic band by burning through a, uh, a thread at this end. Um, and you will see what Newton was on about. I'll just get on the other side of the camera, excuse me. Nice and quiet this time, you can hear me chatter. So I'll burn through the thread. And blow the thread out. Uh, exactly what you'd expect happens, the weight goes in this direction and the frame moves in the opposite direction proportional to each other's weight. Um, really its main purpose I think is, is to open minds, is to show that uh, Newton was a genius, no getting away from that. Um, but the third law of motion should really read uh, every action has uh, an equal and usually opposite reaction. Again, thanks very much for putting up with the waffle. The waffleometer has actually bent the needle, uh, so I'll say thank you again, and I hope this has been of interest to you, and I hope it'll uh, take us further.